Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're hopping back into Cabela's Dangerous Hunts. We're going to hop back into our career and see what's in, for, what's in store for us today. So we left off in spring. We have Wolf in the Dusk, which is take one wolf before nightfall. Uh, Sleepy Bear, which is take one grizzly bear before nightfalls. And Just a Bear, which is take one grizzly bear. So I think what we're going to do, we've had a lot of bear involved in these videos, so I think we're going to go for Wolf in the Dust. Uh, make sure our gear is good. We actually need some more ammo. We're not doing too hot on that. So we're going to go ahead and buy up to 30 bullets, which should do us for a good while. And we're going to hop into it. Alright, so go ahead and get our gun equipped. I do want to apologize for the lack of Fallout 3 streams here lately. Uh, I've been having... Okay, well, there's a wolf. We're going to go ahead and just see. Get a shot off on it. I don't know if it's going to make the other one charge us. But I think we actually shot right over it here. Alright, yeah, so our other one's going to charge us. Just go ahead and You are not allowed to hunt animals you don't have tags for. Um, this is your first warning. Okay. So we can only shoot one. Uh, that's my fault. Anyways, I'm sorry for the lack of Fallout 3 streams. I've been having a bunch of technical issues on my end of the game. So I haven't been able to get a stream out like I've wanted to. Um until I get it fixed, I will be streaming every Wednesday. Or, I'm sorry. I'll be streaming every Tuesday, and it more than likely will be a PUBG stream until I can get my issues fixed. I cannot believe I missed that. And I am surprised this wolf is still alive. Oh my goodness. I don't know how many times I've shot it. I don't even know where it is, actually. Where's it at? Oh, I didn't even realize it ran on bias. The charging us? It is. And I still miss? There we go. So it scored 114 points, and we got $58 for it. Well done. You have completed the... Alright, so now we're in the summer. We have Player's Bay, which is take one white-tailed deer. Uh, get them all, which is fill all tags. Mountain Goat and Dolph Sheep. Choices, which is take one elk or mountain goat with the bow. And Messenger of Mercy. An elk has been wounded by another hunter and must be tracked down and taken by you. So, I think what we're gonna do is... We haven't gotten a good look at elk so far, so we're going to do the elk hunt. Uh, we don't need any gear, so we're just going to get right in it. Alright, so we have to take down a wounded elk. So I guess we're going to go try and find it. So I believe once I finish up the career for this game, we're going to be moving on to another throwback game. And I'd like to know what you guys want to see. Uh, do you guys want to see another Cabela's game? Do you want to see you know, a Need for Speed game? Uh, you guys drop a comment and let me know what you want to see. And uh, we'll make sure we can get that out. I'd love to do a throwback series on a bunch of old PS2 games. So if you have a favorite that you know you want to see, drop a comment. And I'm sure with time we will get to it. So there is our elk that's going to roll into the water, and we actually have, I believe it's a coyote, that's just going to walk on and do its thing, so we're going to go down here and get our elk. So it weighed 655 pounds, we got $235 for it, scored 193 points, and 
whoever shot it somehow, some way, did not kill it. That was a really good shot on it. But hey, we'll take that. Well done. You. So now we're moving on to autumn. We have bait, which is take one doll sheep and use it to lure four wolves. The peacemaker, which is take one mountain lion with a handgun. Great Moosey is take the impressive moose located in this map. Lion bait, which is kill one mule deer and use its meat to lure a mountain lion. More bear, which is take three black bears. And wolf country, which is take down, or track down and take the wounded moose in wolf country. I think I really want to do Peacemaker so we can get a look at the pistols in this game. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do Peacemaker. We're going to sell our rifle on our scope. And let's take a look at what pistols we have. I believe they're under defense. Yeah. So we have the 44 revolver, the 454 revolver, and the 4570 revolver. We don't have the most money, so I think we're just going to go with the 44 revolver because we're probably going to end up selling it right after this mission. So we'll get plenty of bullets, and I believe we're good to go. Alright, so we are in here now, and we are going to go find our mountain lion. I absolutely love the map design in this game. I know I talked about that last video, but every time I get on a new map, or just, you know, the season changes. It just, it blows me away how good it looks. It really hurts that the new hunting games can't be as diverse as the old ones. And I don't understand why. But just thinking about a game like this and what it would look like in today's time, it's just, it's mind-blowing what it could be. I believe you could actually fall down in these fissure cracks. I'm not going to try it, but I'm almost certain you can. So I think I remember doing that as a kid. Is that pronghorn actually charging us? I'm sorry, what? It was actually charging us. Oh my god. What the hell? What the fuck is going on? I did not know they would attack you. That's incredible. So I think we're finally getting close to our mountain line. Yeah, I believe our mountain line is just right here. What feels like forever, we finally got up to it. Yes, yeah, so there's our mountain line, and I wonder if it's going to charge. Yes, it's going to charge. And we are going to miss our shots. Aiming in this game is harder than it looks. God, oh my. Oh no, we, we're running out of bullets here. There we go. <laughs> we got our mountain lion. So it weighed 163 pounds. We got $176 and it scored 26 points. Well done. So we're in the winter now. We have Northern Strike, which is take one Kodiak bear with one shot from a rifle. We have Ambush, which is take one elk, then use its meat as bait for three coyotes. We have the King. There is a white tailed deer with a particularly large rack in this area. Take it. Uh, take one white tail with the bow and take three Gimsbok. I think we're gonna go with the Gimsbok because I've wanted to get to this map. So we're definitely gonna sell this pistol. And since we're going for Gimsbok, we might try and get a stronger rifle since we have the extra money right now. I think we're gonna go for the 416 Magnum because we do have the extra money right now. I'm probably going to spend more than I want to here, but we are going to go for it. Alright.
so we had to restart our hunt. For some reason, one of our Gimsbok actually disappeared off the map. And I do not remember that happening. So we had to restart, which is a shame because one of the Gimsbok we killed was a really nice one. So we're just going to go for it again. See if we can't get it taken care of. There's one Gimsbok. There's two Gimsbok. And right there is our third, and it just ran around the hill. And it's actually going over to where that Gimsbok last time disappeared in. So, I know there's a hyena coming this way, but we... We're gonna go ahead and take our Gimsbok. So we don't lose it. Oh shit, fuck. I knew it was coming, but Jesus Christ, I didn't know it was that close. So here's our first skims bot. We have 321 pounds, we have $427, and it's called 103. It's a decent sized skims bot. Here's our second Gims Bok. It weighed 282 pounds. We got $374 and scored 58 points, which is really, really small. It's smaller than the one we got last time, which was pretty small. Alright, so our third Gims Bok weighed 378 pounds. We got $502 for it, which is more than the others. But it only scored 94 points, which was less than the first one we got, which is still a nice Jim's bog. Jim's bog. Well done. You've. All right. So now on to our charter hunt. We're gonna be in British Columbia, Williams Lake, Spring. We can hunt wolf. So we can only hunt wolf and one at that so we're gonna get a wolf tag uh we have a lot of money so i believe we're gonna sell our rifle and buy the strongest one we can which is the 510 magnum and get plenty of ammo for it and i believe we're good to go this is a little overkill but we're gonna go for it So it only allowed us to get the wolf tag, and it looks like there's two wolves we could choose from. I believe we're just going to take the first one we come up on. But we do have the 510 Magnum, which is the strongest rifle we can buy in this game. So I'm wondering if it's going to give us trouble like the other rifles have, but the amount of times it takes to actually kill something as small as a wolf, or if we're just going to be able to one-shot it no matter what. It's going to be interesting to see. I believe we are coming up on a wolf now. Yes, I believe they're both right here together, so... Probably going to be able to kill both, but only take one. So, yeah. Let's see. I can't... So I think this one is bigger. So we're going to take it and drop it. Which I figured this 510 would allow us to just drop them. I believe this other one's going to charge us, so well, if it is, we're going to let it charge us. But if not, we're just going to walk right up to our wolf. And what's that behind it? I'm not too sure. Yeah, it's going to charge. Is it? Yeah, it's going to charge. I think. And we missed our shot. Take that. And I believe that was actually a sheep over there. But we're gonna pick up a wolf. It's cool. 220 we got $224 for it. it weighed 135 pounds and it scored 136 points. Which is a decent sized wolf, I would say. Congratulations. Alright, well I believe that's gonna do it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Um I hope you guys are enjoying the series. I cannot wait to pick up where we left off, and I will for sure see you in the next one.